Hello there guys, and welcome back to a new review. And as you can see, I will be taking a look at the brand new Schleich 2019 Diabloceratops. Now, Diabloceratops, which name means Devil Horned Face, is a genus of Centrosaurine Ceratopsian that lived in the late Cretaceous period 79.9 million years ago in what is now Utah. It was around 18 feet long and estimated at around 2 tons in weight. And it shared its environment with the Hadrosaur Acristavus, the Lambiosaur Adelalophus, and the Tyrannosaur Lythronax, which most likely preyed upon it. Now, Diabloceratops is a really unique looking ceratopsian. So when we saw images of this figure earlier this year, we were quite surprised. I mean, it looked really nice, and Diabloceratops is a very unique ceratopsian to choose. And I think Schleich have done a really, really nice job of this animal. Now, I recently got this at a toy shop around the Wooden Bassett area. Uh, I don't know if any of you guys in the UK know where that, that is, but Royal Wooden Bassett is a very uh, cool place to visit. So yeah, they had a little toy shop there. They showed, sold a lot of Schleich figures, and this is where I got this one from. But yeah, it's uh, it's really, really cool. Without further ado, let's take a look at the model. Starting off with the head sculpt. The head sculpt is really, really nicely done. Uh, the eyes and picked out in a beautiful bright yellow. Got the nostril there, we've got the beak. Uh, the tongue is sort of protruding out of the mouth as it's roaring. Uh, there's a wonderful pattern on the frill with the body sort of um, chocolate brown with dark brown along the edges uh, with white and then black stripes and then yellow eye spots on the frill. It's a very striking looking head sculpt, especially for a Schleich figure. The, even the ear holes have been picked out, which is something that Schleich very rarely have done. Uh, the horns are done in a nice black colour. Uh, even the epicytals along the side of the frill, they've been nicely sculpted on there as well. Going down, down the body with some really nice scalation, as you can see, they've been uh, nicely picked out as well. You can see the rest of the coloration, the dark brown black stripes along the chocolate brown body. And then as we go towards the feet, it's sort of like a light grey, greyish white colour. The feet have been done very nicely, though once again the feet are inaccurate. Uh, with Ceratopsians, they only had three toes touching the ground and two vestigial toes, but like all Schleich figures, they've all been painted, which isn't a huge nitpick for me, but it is, ho hope, it is hopefully something that they will fix in the future. There is some nice uh, muscle contortion and detail along the side of the legs here. And also on this side, especially here, you can see the muscle detail as the leg is pulled back. There's some nice detail here on the tail as well. The tail is in a nice curved position. So yeah, this is a really awesome looking Ceratopsian figure. I mean, Schleich's Triceratops from last year was one of their best. And the Diabloceratops, I'd say, is arguably better. And for a little comparison, here we have... Safari's Diabloceratops from 2013 and Collector's Diabloceratops also from 2013. I think the three of these um, figures together it really shows a nice contrast. Um, it, it can make it like a, uh, a nice little herd. Uh, so yeah I think all these the three figures look great together. My personal favorite would be the Safari one as it is more accurate. And then my second favourite would be the Schleich one, and then last would be the Collector one. But yeah, all three of these figures I think are really, really awesome. And there's also one other thing that's actually quite surprising. Now, I found this out via Dinosaur Toy Forum, a review for it. If you turn it this way, <laughs> he actually stands on his horns. I don't know if this is if the sculptor designed it like this to do it this way, if this was intentional, but yeah, it actually stands really well on the horns. So uh, 
if you want to have your Ceratopsian like this, go ahead. But, uh, yeah, it's a really interesting way of designing the horns. <laughs> so, I hope you guys have enjoyed this review of the brilliant Schleich 2019 Diablo Ceratops. You can also pick it up at Everything Dinosaur. I will leave a link in the description box below where you can pick it up. It's a fantastic figure. I highly recommend you guys pick it up. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this review. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Please take care and have a great day. Bye.